I know, back by popular demand, you guys have missed this beautiful mug so much. I got it. You're almost done. You got about 15 school days left with me. And then, see you later, alligator. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to do divide in fractions, okay? The problem we have is Jada had one-fourth of her birthday cake left. She and her mom and her dad split it evenly. How much of the overall cake will they each get? So what is it asking us to solve? It's asking us to solve what, Liam? It's asking us to solve how much will Jada and mom and dad get? Of the overall cake. Will they each get, okay? What do we know, Alex? Uh, there's one fourth of a birthday cake left. Yeah, so the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to model a birthday cake. And I'm going to make it a sheet cake so it looks pretty easy, okay? And I'm sure it was a Star Wars cake because today is May the Force Be With You. Okay? So I'm going to divide my cake into a fourth, okay? And I know that they have one fourth of the cake left. So I'm going to shade that in. Okay. So we know that Jada has one fourth of a cake. What is it asking us? How many ways do I need to split my one fourth of a cake up left? Mikkel. Into three. Into threes because Jada wants to slice her mom and her dad. So the way I'm going to do that is I'm going to split my overall cake up into thirds. Okay, so my first thing I had is right here I had one-fourth left, right? Okay, then I'm going to divide it. Divide it by three. Okay, what is the overall portion that each person got? Alex, take a chance. I got you. Make a mistake so we can learn. One what? But in ratio to the overall cake. Paul. One twelve. Thank you. And this is why, Alex. Because they each got a piece, right? But how many pieces did the overall cake when we divided it by three? We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So Jada's piece was one twelve. So each will get will get one piece out of twelve. Out of okay, our so our actual equation that we did that we did was one fourth divided by three equals one twelve. Okay, whenever we divide a fraction by a whole number, it's always going to be smaller than the fraction we started with because we had one fourth and we had to split it up. So it gets smaller, okay? Now, this is using a visual. The other way we could do this is with the standard algorithm, okay? And the way I would do that is I would do one fourth divided by... Three, and what I would do is I would use our strategy that our keep, flip, change, KFC. So I want to keep one fourth. Okay, so I'm going to rewrite this and I'm going to keep one fourth. I want to change from division to multiplication, and the reason I change from division to multiplication. Is my second number when I'm one fourth divided by three? What I'm dividing by is called my. I want to find the reciprocal because I changed from division to multiplication. So in order to find the reciprocal of three, 
I need to know that a whole number is 3 over 1. So I flip it. The reciprocal is the complete opposite. And I do 1 third. So then I would multiply across. 1 times 1 is 1. 4 times 3 is 12. So I would get the same answer. I would have 1 12. So I can either draw a visual or I could multiply it using the standard algorithm. Okay? All right, guys. Last video for today, for right now. All right. Everybody can do amazing on Monday and Tuesday. I know you guys can do this, and I know it's going to be really easy. All right, guys. Have a great weekend.